first note on a Clockwork Orange by Anthony Burgess. Uh, exceptional, um, mesmerizing, fantastic, elating, exhilarating masterpiece. Uh, one of the best books I know. Included, uh, as a matter of fact, on the list of best books by the Modern Library and I'm sure others. Uh, the top 100 best uh, books in English uh, for the last century, the 20th century. Um, it is even, I would say, more impressive that someone who has trouble, uh, and I'm sure I'm not the only one, understanding many of these words, uh, can still uh, feel um, exalted by, by, by this. Um, it's true, that's part of the magic. There's so many words that Alex and his drugs, did you say that, uh, use uh, that sound uh, exceptional. Forella, Forella comes to mind again as an example. And um, the modernity, the, 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 um, um, the atmosphere created. I, I'm <laughs> I think I'm so high on this that uh, I'm losing a note here. Um, plus, there's these guys who contribute, contribute to the distraction, but they're here to improve the uh, experience for a potential viewer who's, if he's bored by what I say, maybe he's um, compensated by uh, those two birds. Um, true, the violent side of the of the plot of the story is uh, unique and uh, appalling at times but then the message is if you're violent it's not encouraging violence if you if you're violent if one is violent uh, the result is uh, is bad uh, actually Alex, the hero, takes such a bad turn that um, we feel pity for him for a while. The, the, this is a famous movie, Stanley, Stanley Kubrick, uh, Malcolm McDowell in, in the lead role, Stanley Kubrick as director, wonderful uh, artist, creator. Um, uh, I've created the uh, uh, the two of them, mainly Kubrick, I would say, because Martin McDonald, uh, McDonald or maybe I have the name wrong, uh, went on to make movies, but when he didn't have material and he didn't have a good director, uh, what he did was not so exceptional. As opposed to Kubrick, who uh, in almost any of his movies, uh, he has created a masterpiece. Um, there's the image of Alex, uh, with his eyes uh, forced to open, uh, which I'm sure stays in the mind of the public, of the viewer. I'll come back to this because I'm so fascinated by it. 